Dallin Perry, that's bad news. Uh, it would be. Uh, we got to see how you know what the prognosis is. Both of them had injuries today. Yeah, that would affect us in a lot of ways. It did look bad, or uh, I only saw the one. It didn't look quite as bad. Uh, the other one was a pileup, so you can never tell. Uh, is, is Aaron out this week, or Aaron's out for the season? Aaron's got broken ribs. Oh man, is that a pretty big blow? Yeah, and uh, yeah, it is for us. Yeah, I feel bad for the young man. As much much work as he's put in, him and Jamil Showers and Fossa, you know, those guys put a lot of work in to have him out. You know, it's hard to see them on the sidelines. I'll tell you that. So Fossa out for the year too. Uh, more than likely. Yeah, he had he had some players. Uh, do a little story on life, which I guess, uh, boy, 100, 123 schools put a pretty big emphasis on how tall they are, and I guess you didn't, right? Yeah, you know, I had an opportunity to see every pass he ever completed, every run he ever had, and uh, it's competitive nature. And, uh, he's really uh, kind of a legend up in that area. He's one of the most productive quarterbacks in Western Pennsylvania. He's a state player of the year. He only had uh, one other Division I offer, and uh, that was the Air Force Academy. And he had committed to uh, Stephen F. Austin, which is a 1AA school, but he wanted the chance to play Division I football. So when I got the job, uh, he was the first player I offered. He's going to be a really good quarterback. For this he answered this a lot last week. What is it about him that today was You know what? He's got great knowledge for the game. And, uh, you know, even though he is uh, shorter, he's got a very strong arm, a uh, very accurate arm. And uh, probably the number one thing is he's extremely competitive. What's he like uh, as a kid? I guess he's your son's best friend. Yeah, they're good friends. He's extremely quiet. Really? Yeah, not my son. No. <laughs> <laughs> He's extremely quiet. But your son said when he comes out of his shell, he can. Yeah, he's he's, he's got a good sense of humor, but he's uh, he's very quiet. But is he a vocal leader on the field? Yeah, he'll, he'll get after the guys and uh, he'll express his uh, feelings. And again, his competitive nature comes out when he plays. See, uh, do you have to be a leader as a, even as a true freshman in that position? Uh, you know, maybe not vocally. Because uh, guys sometimes that are with your seniors, they may not listen to a freshman as far as vocal. But with your uh, with your actions, you know, I know the other day when they see him take some of the hits that he took and go right back in the huddle and go back and compete, uh, that's how you earn respect in this game. So uh, I think he's earned their respect.